Hello, hello, hello. Uh, JV Dash Dash and Ali Machiavelli here. Um, we're going to give you a, a good guide on how to beat the levels and call up on Crush in uh, this is Chapter Two, London Underground. Um, I, you know, I people still have trouble with these levels, and uh, we're going to help you. We're going to show you a good, surefire way to them. I'm I'm going to be commentating, and now he's going to be you know playing in you from his point of view. Best boosters, you know, to use in co-op. People always ask, oh, what boosters do you use? Well, I always use the same two boosters, and Ali does as well. Uh, regeneration and team state. Team state has up team. You can throw your grenades, and they won't hurt them. Regeneration, you can manage to take cover, heal really quickly, and then get back to the action instead of having to hide for a little bit. But, anyways, let's do this. Um, let's first a bit. No real way to stand and just stay back and don't overwhelm yourself. Okay, just be out there be wanting um, either side. Watch up top here. There's going to be a few G words. Um, just shoot them down. Okay. Uh, you don't want to run into this. You know, kind of want to come in and then get back out because a lot of people continuously. Yeah, they'll be running all over in that area. If you were to run into there, you would just be screwed. You know what you see then we start up then uh just you know move on up and uh, get in there. Take them out. Oh yeah, watch your back because the there will be those snipers that spawn up on top of the trains here. Kill them really quickly. Alright, so up. Um, I think there's the power weapon in this area. Um, yeah, there's over here. There is the over oh, on this train. Yeah, here it is. There's a TAU sniper right here. Uh not many people think about this. But yeah, it's right there. TAU. Woohoo. Okay. Okay, this next part it's kind of difficult because uh, your main objective is to blow the RP, you know, blow the wall here with the RP. You want to hurry up and get that RP because the, the enemies are going to continuously spawn. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and try to rush up and get the RPG, but you want to be careful because a bunch of chokers come running at you, and there's snipers on the trains, and armored enemies, and riot shielders, and all that kind of great stuff. The sooner you blow up the door, the quicker they'll stop spawning, and the quicker you can move on. First priority really is to take out the chokers here because they're the most annoying enemies of the, the whole level. They really like to spawn in this level. Alright, let's go get that RPG. Mmm, look at that, he found me. RPG. I got it. And you can uh you can blow it up from the pit stand. So if you blow it up, you get the checkpoint and you can move on. Alright, let's move on up. Okay. Oh, crap, there's somebody still there. Get out. Okay. Next bit, two, R uh, two riot shielders come at you. Uh, nothing to worry about, really. Just toss a grenade underneath them, and they're dead. So, one time. Oh, I don't have a grenade. Crap. Oh, sorry. Okay. Two enemies here, nothing to worry about. Okay, now, you have... Do, do you want me to explain the power weapons? There's... The power weapons, there... There is the hammer, an M32 hammer over here. You, you want to leave it for the next bit, because... It's more useful in other areas. I think got a Mag 5 over here on top of this large bat creature. And, um, if you really want to use it, you can, but I wouldn't use it because it, it, it comes in more handy in the next part. So just leave it and, uh, just stick down here. Uh, the easiest way, now this is pr pretty much the hardest part in the level, is because you got constant chokers and RPG, um, shotguns spawning on you. You just want to stay here by this big book and take out the chokers sparse because they'll get annoying. They'll catch you and when there's a grenade under you and a shotgun guy will shoot you down when he's choking you. Just look for those white coats because there's no armored ones in this bit. Just the white coats. Look for them and kill them quickly because they're coming for you. things get a little overcrowded, just switch sides, because now they're all going to be going for that side to go, and you get time to think. get overwhelmed quickly, you just gotta, you wanna make, you know, try to kill them off really quickly and not die. Um, choking is your one true weakness here. If you're getting choked, that's a chance for them to swarm you and then it's all over. You wanna kill them quickly. Jokers are relentless. 
they will not stop. You know, grenades don't even really affect them. They just keep running at you. Provide your teammates quickly. Don't let them sit there and linger. You want to get them up quickly because, you know, you get full health when you revive them and you, you know, have enough extra gun, you know, to shoot people with. So, you want know, get them up quickly. Don't leave them there. So nice. I believe there's three armored shotgun guys. You want to kill them quickly, but also keep your distance from them because they're really annoying. Alright. Quickest way to kill him? Bust a bomb under the feet. He's dead. No really difficult way, you know, unless you don't have a cluster bomb. Keep your distance from them and just keep something around them because. His shotgun is very effective, very deadly, and he never has to reload it for some odd reason. 